If you need to write equivalent fractions for 1 eighth, that's 1 over 8, here's how you do it. If we multiply this by 1, it would still be 1 eighth. But what we can do is multiply by 2 over 2. 2 divided by 2, that's still 1. But now 2 times 1 is 2, 2 times 8 is 16, and this is an equivalent fraction. 1 eighth and 2 sixteenth, they're equal to the same decimal value. 0 0.125. Let's do another equivalent fraction for 1 eighth. How about we multiply by 3 over 3? 3 times 1 is 3, 3 times 8 is 24, and if you divide 3 by 24, it equals 0 0.125, just like the other equivalent fractions for 1 eighth. Let's try one more. How about 7 over 7? That gives us 756, another equivalent fraction, and again, all of these equivalent fractions are the same value, 0 0.125, they're just written with a different numerator and denominator. This is Dr. B with the equivalent fractions for 1/8. Thanks for watching.